New details about the final moments of the jet that crashed at Hanscom Field, killing seven people on board. This as investigators continue to remove and document the wreckage. Let's get to News Center 5's Julie Lunchek. She's live in Bedford right now. Julie? So, Ed, those two black boxes recovered captured hours of data, including the final few seconds of the Gulfstream 4, in which pilots can be heard, according to NTSB, talking about air traffic, air, excuse me, aircraft control, and that was after this plane started rolling. These two black boxes recovered Monday shed new light on what actually happened on board the Gulfstream 4 before its crash. Both the captain and co pilot are heard making speed call outs of 80 knots, V1, and rotate. Ground roll to the end of the cockpit data recorder is 49 seconds. Investigators with NTSB said the aircraft ultimately reached 165 knots. It did not lift off the runway, and recordings indicate pilots were aware of a problem. After the rotate call out, the CBR captured comments concerning aircraft control. FDR data shows thrust reverses deploying and wheel brake pressures rising as the aircraft decelerates. An aviation expert I just spoke with tells me that data, coupled with the skid marks seen on the runway that we showed you yesterday, indicates these pilots were indeed trying to abort this takeoff. NTSB will remain here throughout the week. However, the wreckage will begin leaving today and again tomorrow. Reporting live at Hanscom, Julie Lonchek, WCBB News Center 5.